Hey guys, Dark Silver Jesse here. Uh, I am gonna do a bit of gameplay here, so don't be worried. Just saying, we're playing on a server, the Madhouse Gaming Cluster, that uh, has the Arc Oblivion mod. Now, what that mod is is a uh, basically an overhaul of the dinosaurs. You get things like the uh, Apex, the Alpha, the Spectral, Poison, Flaming, just all these different versions of uh, dinosaurs. It's a new mod, so they're still updating it, I understand. And, yeah, it, it gets kind of interesting at times. Because, uh, well, let's go out here. You have this table right here, the Oblivion Workbench. And yes, I've got a kitty. Um, now to make that wonderful little piece there, you have to go out and get 250 Alpha Hide, 125 Crystal, 120 Metal Ingot, and 150 Silica Pearls. Depending on where you spawn, crystals are easy to get. Metal takes a little bit of time, but you get there. Silica pearls, just killing the crustaceans. That alpha hide is the kicker for getting it. Because, frankly, you have to have... Oh, okay. This little puppy right here, the Killmonger 9000, all right. It's the chainsaw that chops, slices, dices, and goes all over town. But here's the fun part with this little baby right here, right here. It's considered an exotic chainsaw because the Oblivion mod changes what would be your uh, ascendant into exotic. Your epic still epic. Your ramshackle is now rare. And things like that. Now, base level stuff where is uh, common. It puts it as a loot table, not as other. Which is alright. But if you go hacking on an alpha with a rare chainsaw, you ain't gonna get no alpha hide. If you do, maybe three or four pieces. Even with them about to up the level of pieces that you can get, it will still take a while, even with the rare chainsaw. You have to have the exotic, or at the very least, legendary, or epic. But, what, where are you going to get those? Well, from those wonderful little drops over there. Oh, let's see if I can get over this. Er. Then once you get it, we'll go with this one first. You can get one of these little spectral pteranodons. Pretty guy. Okay, I'll put you back up. The all too lovely apex. And this boy right here is the black version. There's also gold, red, green, all kinds. Which I'll be taking the apex out for the rest of this. Me and my little kitty riding on the lap. Now the reason why I spawned him in there is there is a current glitch that is being worked on. Where sometimes they'll just start walking away. Or if they're a flyer, they'll fly away. Okay, let's see if I can get around here and find some of the wonderful fun. I know I'm close to some. How you'll find an apex is they will be attacking things on the beach. Or just randomly attacking anything that is their tier or lower. They will not attack like a Bronto. There we go. There's a... Wonderful spectral. Let's go ahead and cycle that so I can 
145 spectral, pretty good there. Except they are weak. They really don't have any special abilities. They just look cool. Let's see, is that an apex? Nope, just a regular. There is a greater number of uh, dinos, even d just how the overhaul is set right now. Poison wyverns. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the mod developer put wyverns on the island and put them just in general areas. And yeah. But there is Alpha Trikes, Raptors, Allosaurs, Spinos, Pteranodons, Griffins, Wyverns, Argentavis, and Gigas. And that's the Alpha. Uh, there, there's so many more listed under the uh, Apex and Spectral and Fiery and all that. Now one thing I'm running into is the wyverns that get put on this map are supposed to be tameable. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Because uh, all the ones that are spawning here are not tameable. Ah, oh, I missed him barely. Let's clear out the trees, shall we? Ah, it died. Sweet. But yeah. Let's see. You standard ra alpha. Not tameable, so it's a regular alpha raptor. With 11,000 health. Five count three, two, one. Go back up. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I think I saw an alpha carno there. Didn't I? Nope, just regular carno. Uh, had the coloration of an alpha, but oh well. It sounds like I killed that regular. Did my little... It did. When did I get right here? Well, just picked it up off that alpha. Holy crap. Oh, I got a bit of tech, actually. Oh, I can't wear it yet, because I hadn't learned it yet. That's a pretty good loot off that. A chibi griffin. Yes. There. Uh, no. Sabertooth, come off. Griffin, you may fly along with me. Except. And another rifle. Decent gear, decent loot. Oh, you had the. We'll go for a bit more melee damage, because that took longer than it should have. But yeah, it, it's uh, definitely. A bit more interesting it took me a while because as you saw I killed a alpha but it wasn't the modded alpha meaning that even though it's an alpha it didn't drop alpha hide so I wouldn't have been able to put anything towards that table let's go ahead and snipe this while I'm here and 
keep on going. Let's see if we can find an actual modded alpha. Just, just giving you a rundown of how difficult it is. Because presently you're only running across alpha megs, alpha trikes, and alpha pteranodons. Because it's spawning in the regular alpha raptors and alpha rexes. I'll check down here. See, I don't see any of the flames that would be uh, associated with them. Let's go ahead and land, get some more stam. Not like I won't be able to kill anything that comes my way. And yeah. We're good to go. Alright, I see green. Let, let's see, is this a poison trike? Nope, just standard trike. Nope. Oh, there's a wyvern. Let's see, any alphas in here? Any alphas? I don't see any red glow. Let's check the overspawn. I just see a ton of vanilla. Not really much in the way of modded's. Unique colors, but no. Check the carnivore trench. Nope. Now I'll keep heading north and see what or if anything I can find up there. Because this is my own, only my second day with a flyer. And... I haven't really been able to tame anything else because it's either hyper aggressive and makes it ridiculous. See, it says not tameable. Yeah. Boop. Alright, heading on north. Let's go ahead and pump that point into some speed. Hey! Didn't see that before. Alright. Works for me. Got some sap from somewhere. Probably from the alpha. Probably didn't see it. But I know. You gotta fly down close to get things pegged out. But frankly, there's just so many vanillas that it does lag a bit with the overspawn. And I don't know if that's the server side settings or the mod settings that are doing it. I'm not an admin by any means, any measure. I don't have any admin ability, power, or suggestion, so. Makes it really, really interesting. Missed me. No, I can stay right at your tail. Catch it. Dang it, I was gonna chainsaw that dragon, I will. Argentavis, what Argentavis? <laughs> oh, I do love playing Ark. Ark is my go to game. But, well, between that and Minecraft, and let's be honest, Minecraft is. Uh, <clears throat> pretty much dead. Ark is starting to get there if it doesn't get its uh, 
modability cleaned up. Apex Giga. Let's have some fun. do we have in here? Some goods. A lot of bads, but some goods. Just a mountain away, that way that Giga doesn't drop on us. And I... Don't need that, don't need that. No. I don't really ever use a pike. No need for stone tools. Got a rocket launcher, that's nice. And alright, that'll work for now. Let's head out towards Carnivore Island, see what we got out here. See what has been put out on Carnivore Island. Because as you've seen from the number of pteranodons I've passed and scanned over, I didn't see a single poison. So I wonder if they're only on Ragnarok, because I'm not finding them on the island. Coming on in. Coming on in. Do, do, do. Okay, you're up there. What do you got? Kibble and a pheromone dart. Not really what I would call pinnacle. Now see, I expected this to be swarming with dragons. Just because this is Carnivore Island. You know, I kind of expect the tops of mountains to have dragons. And Carnivore Island to have dragons, but... Honestly, I, I'm not seeing it. But I understand, the island is one of the least visited, not so much least liked, but least visited of all the maps. And that has a thousand percent to do with the fact that it's, well, the original. That and most mod developers, you know, start their mod on it and uh, then move on elsewhere. I know the entrance is right in here somewhere. Just in case. Gotta, gotta relearn to speak my thoughts there. Alright. Over and counter. Uh, let's go by weight since it's over encumbrance. Alright. Go the other way. I can get more hide easily, more meat. Metal I can get by the thousands, keep that. Get rid of that and that. Charcoal, the. That took my weight down to manageable. Um, don't want the bunk bed. Pull my 
stuff off there, put it over here, and then that one can go away. All right. These are still really weighed down. Oh, I still have junk tools in here, and no, I don't. Well, I, I want desert pants. Um, I'll get rid of my standard flak there. Since I've got better flak. Put you on you. I know, so exciting watching me sort. There, that. Should allow for regular movement. I wonder, can I use it in here? Passive tameable with spoiled meat. Instantly adverse. Let's see here. See what see what I can do. Because this is kind of new to me. I'm used to knocking these guys out, not just feeding them. Come on. Use some food. Come on. Do you not use food any? I don't want to touch the shoreline yet. Hmm. So I have to get attacked by it. Come on, your oxygen's not going to hold out. start taking damage it's gonna get real messy let's go let's go let's go floating along with the wilder in y'all except come on I guess that works. You get to carry that.
No, okie dokie. Nobody's touching down, nobody's... I don't have anything to be able to save the dung beetles. And it went haywire there, but hey. Can't do that. Yeah, I'm gonna put that back there. All right. Say, where the heck did it go? Gonna have to pick back up that stuff, I guess. Yeah, no. Don't really need any of it. I'll take that. Like to leave behind what we can get rid of that. That that don't need to hide. Don't really need that.
still too heavy. But to go. berries I guess and dang it it's everything else I want to keep too heavy to jump well hell I gotta get rid of something sulfur can go away I got plenty of silica pearls I don't need that right now. That'll that should free me up enough. All right. Because if you can't jump, you can't grapple. Metal sickle, mammoth saddle. All right, all right. Where are you? Standard RG, standard raptors. Standard, standard, standard. Doesn't look like any of the mods out here. Our mobs out here have been altered. It was similar on Herbivore Island, too. The, there was no modded dinos on Herbivore Island. So Corno Island, of course, would be uninhabited as well. Really sad. Really sad. Oh. Echo, 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 echo. No. I'm bored. It's all right. I don't have my fast pteranodons anymore. I have to sacrifice speed for strength. Nailed it. All right. He's the ace that can't be stopped. I, I watch way too much arc, and given the fact that I haven't uploaded in a long time, I should tell you guys, <laughs> I've been watching a lot of it more than playing it. So, um, that being said, favorite arc uh, streamers, content creators, etc. Starting off with Slipgator, uh, I miss Mazion and... Zuljan does it every great once in a while. But, uh, Froggy Man, it took a little bit of getting used to, but, you know, he grew on me. I think it was just the awkwardness of starting out that was the, the same stuff that I'm doing right here, right now, that kept me from, uh, enjoying the early works as much as I should have. Trust me, I've gone back. I've rewatched them. They look, they're great. But back in the day, I was just really hypercritical of things that I had no right being critical of. And I've come to realize that. I mean, even me doing this video, overlooking this mod, it's. Not a one of them in alpha. Uh, me being really critical of this mod. It's more of I want to see this mod do good things. 
and certain things that need worked on need developed are frankly being ignored because uh, other things other people want from it and you know you, you make a mid-level game that's fine that's dandy just I wish it wasn't in tier as to when you get the uh, alpha hide. I mean, it's an alpha. It's going to kick your butt. And you got to kill enough of them. Of the modded kind. So they're already even stronger than regular alphas. You got to kill a bunch of them. Just to get the hide to make the table. So you can get a saddle for the lowest tier of the mod. Which is crazy. You have, you have to have the ability to kill the high tiers to get the saddles for the low tiers. And you, ghostly, I know you're probably going to see this because you got it set up where I'm a streamer on your stuff. And we'll find out whenever I upload this if it actually hits it. Um, but yeah, the. If you're planning on putting in more dinos, great. If you're planning on making this a bigger, better mod, great. I look forward to it. I know people are in your ear saying they want it to be a slow progression. And as a, as a server owner, yeah, you want people to stay on your server as long as possible. That's why servers do events and all that. And a couple of bad apples can ruin that for a server owner. But also on the server owner front, if you're paying for a server, it's nice to uh, be able to get through the mod pack somewhat quickly so you're not spending so much money on just trying to play the game. That, that's my point to it all is make a great mod and let let mods be additions to the server say everyone on the server or a vast majority gets to a certain point and then another mod gets unlocked by the server owner and then everybody gets to the point on that and you add another mod and another mod and another mod. You add the mods to add levels to the game. And yeah, any anybody that would be new jumping onto a server that's already had a couple of iterations is going to have a hard time. It, that's that's just how the game's played. But when your fresh wipe requires everyone to clan up and we're all in different time zones just so we can gather enough resources to get anything it's annoying it's sad it's and I don't mean to be mean it's not my intention to be mean on this I say it from the bottom of my heart I want this mod to do well it's an alpha raptor non tameable so right there's one that is not going to drop us any alpha hide. It'll give us good loot. Yeah, see it dropped us a ton of loot. Let's go ahead and kill these off. Alpha Raptor non-tameable. And it only became Alpha after we killed the other Alpha.
He's got 6k health left. I'm playing a dangerous game right there near the water. Three. It's only hitting me for 16. You see that? Alright, now that I don't have anything else around me, really, I'll show you guys. This would be how I'd normally get Alpha Hide. Nothing. Now what's fun here, since we killed a tech grafter, let's go ahead and offload a bunch of stuff here. Give me my gasoline. Nothing inside. Decent amount of stuff from that. If they were to put the uh, alpha, the modded alphas, on a similar spawn rate as like tech, the tech dinos. That would be alright, because it keeps it sparsed out enough to be playable while still being accessible enough through finding it. But I understand you'd be coding for alphas that weren't originally techs. So, I can see how that would be a problem. I'm no coder, but I can see the issue. <laughs> If that makes any sense, probably not. Probably makes no sense whatsoever. And I really haven't seen that many spectrals. It's like the most recent update turned down spectrals. But one spectral, if I can kill it with a. Uh, one spectral. Hey, right, look at that. One, this is a top tier chainsaw, and I only got 590 out of it. Now I understand you're cranking it up a bit tonight for uh, more drops on the leather, on the hide. But even at that, it's still... I, I'm using a top tier chainsaw to gather spectral, and can I only get 590 out of it. Yeah, I only got 590 out of it with a top tier chainsaw. What what am I supposed to do if I have just a crafted chainsaw and I, um yeah, just a crafted chainsaw on an alpha that's already rare. How many alphas am I gonna have to kill just to? Just to meet the needs, you know? It, it... But, yeah, other than that, I enjoy it. I'm having fun, or at least I'm trying to. And, yeah. When vanilla dinosaurs become utterly useless, that's when your mod needs to be somewhat tapered back. Because you, you enter into the territory of just destroying gameplay. If a person can't if a person can't do the mod with vanilla and you set the table to mid to end uh, end game then how is that person 
without without actually going out and finding a crew to join up with and do everything with which is great i mean camaraderie but a lot of us are solo players because we don't trust ourselves and we don't trust others take my last tribe i i i teamed up with moltres and we were we always found ourselves going out and gathering more resources because when one or the other would be on we're used to being solar players whatever resources pop into our table or ours at our disposal and we'd always have to go get more resources because we'd use them all up and if one of us forgot to get more resources or didn't have time Suddenly, the next person's having to spend their gaming session getting resources that uh, they would have otherwise been playing. But yeah, that aside, it's all, it's all good. It's all gravy. Uh, exotic. Uh, what is it? Six ninety nine. So exotic is. A lower tier? Hmm. I, I just need to take a moment. It's part of the reason why I built by a lake. Or by a body of water in general. I forgot I gotta have a chair for this. Gotta be seated. It up, move along. See, I don't see any fish in the area anyway, so it wouldn't be that good of a fishing spot anyway. <laughs> All right. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm bad at making content. <laughs> uh, let's be honest. I'm just bad in general. But how bad can I possibly be? I don't know. Go from 30,000 to three. <laughs> Not three thousand. Three. Hi, idiot. See if I can slink through here. He yeah, aggroed. He yeah, aggroed. I know it. deep enough for him to aggro. Where, 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 where? In the bear? I see I need out there. Because that's where all the feces are.
can I get a fishy? Can I get a fishy? I don't see any fish egg growing to it yet. I think it's a dead. Yep. He's a dead. Ah. Lab a griffin in my face. See if I can position myself a little better here. And the fishing aspect of a game is usually one of the better mechanics. One to take time on. They also expect you to be patient with it. That's not always the case. One last cast. Come on, you rat bastard. See, I put my raft in an area with fish and all the fish go away. He's sad. You coming for it? No. What about you, Manta? Manta? Anybody? Oh, come on. Come on. You're right there. Yay, I pooped myself. Or did you poop yourself? Which one of us pooped? You did. I guess it's better than me. I was trying to be sneaky with that and it's like not ready to defecate. Bull crap, I haven't crapped and crapped and crapped. Oh, come on, Manta. Fine. I'll just take myself home. Let's lead the leads. I know it's right there, so... This is gonna get fun. All right, I'm aimed at home. Let's broaden our horizons. Because I know that Leeds is probably straight down out here somewhere. Oh, there it is. I'm cutting across in a raft. Any other Leeds out here? No. I'm within its... There it is. She's a coming. Can I make it? Probably not. It's quite a bit faster. Oh, look at it coming. Bottom. 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 Come on. Dang it. And it races back out there, don't it? 
<laughs> what have we got? Blueprint. Mm -hmm. Air conditioner. About the only things in there I like are the air conditioner and maybe the gloves. Air conditioner, gloves, blueprint. All other things can drop out. The Rosinosaur. Only 16 major berries. Takes more in sweet cake. What about you? 29 but it has 8.1 torpor which with a standard rifle is 81 darts on the current server settings okay I just saw a big line that disappeared what I hate it when mods do that and I'll probably have to roll back to see but right in here it looked like a titanosaur I even get a little stutter step like it spawned in there. I do know where a titanosaur is because the trees grew back behind its butt as it walked through here. Somewhere right in here there's a titanosaur stomping around. Or there was. Oh, thank you, Dino Wipe. Must have come through since last I was here. But now every time that titanosaur spawns in, it wanders in the same direction, just taking a straight path inward. La -da 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 -da. See, I don't even have any fishes over here, which is odd, because, I'm sorry, on vanilla, this area, it's packed like that. But it's all over, not just right there. Ooh, dang hiccup. Oh, dokie. So you don't wander off. I do like these little cages. Every now and then that one will scream. This scares the hell out of me when it does. Here's my normal seat. Just sit here, stare at my fire. Which I find it interesting. The uh, four levels of alpha. Gorilla, spider, dragon, manticore. It, I'd like to see more artwork with like Genesis and Extinction with that. But, uh, I don't think it's going to happen. It's not that the community's dying off for this. I mean, you guys are watching this. But, they're not being as involved as they once were. And it's really, really, really sad. Because, yeah, I enjoy the community. I enjoy the game. So whenever it's not faring well, not doing well, you know, we'll stick the air conditioner right behind the couch. It's unpowered right now, which is fine. But once I get my generator, I'll set it up underneath here and run power lines up. Or if I get the wireless one. Yeah. Goody, plenty, all right. Oh yeah. How are you on fuel? 109. 64 dodo eggs. Oh, turtle egg. I don't have any gotchas because I haven't been to that map yet. 
fruitlings. So they're matures. Which one was oh narco? Okay, so they all look like that. So I ought to be able to make my potions now. Ought to be able to. And this video has gone on way too long. So. Yeah. Gonna see y'all later. And let's see what the other one is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's gonna be. See you later. And stay strong. No. Not say stay strong. I think it is stay strong. So see you later. Stay strong. This is Dark Silver Jesse signing out. Have a wonderful one. Peace.